cold, so. And this is the first time it snowed in a while. I think the last time it snowed was like September for one day and then it stopped. Yeah. Hopefully uh, the snow is at like a mild level. We don't really want an ice age here. Yeah. Anyways, so is it five starters? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's five. Yeah, it's five. Is Midgar legal? Nah. So can I, I like to, uh, New Year CSB make Midgar legal, man? <laughs> like a I'll probably do a side event with it legal. Legal counter pick. I mean, I played off on it a few times and like. It's not that bad. It's not. It's yeah. It's really not that bad. It's like Halberd. It's not if that anything, bad. If anything, if anything, it kind of adds to it. You know. There's no really bad stuff in it. Like, oh my god, I can't believe I just died at like two percent. I think the only one that's really bad is the tide where you get pulled off. It's like jungle drapes yeah, in 3DS. That's, that's, that's the worst part of it. That's the most ratchet summon. Uh, of course, they're thinking about their bands, you know. Uh, I actually really don't know how this team would work, though. You know, Yoshi Sheik. I assume that Yoshi would try and get a lot of damage done, where Sheik would also try and just be nimble and quick. Yeah. Sheik in teams, though, I just don't feel it's that good of a... She in teams, I feel is just perfect for like setting up uh, combos. Yeah. Otherwise, team I feel that's it. It's just team like combos and her basically trying to like keep it at neutral for whoever team she's on. Yeah, which is why I feel like Yo and Raycom do so well when they team with each other. Yeah. You no, know, because Yo always gets to grab and stuff, and then into Raycom's super warlock punch up tilt combo. Yeah. Forward air, back air, up air, all that stuff. And then Anyways. Sheik Needles can disrupt a lot of things, too. That's the best part about having Sheik in teams, yeah. though, is that, like, you're getting comboed, and then I'll save you, man. Anyways, game one on Battlefield. And now, Hey Arnold, actually, a player I've heard about, uh, but I've never actually seen him play. Uh, he's actually pretty decent. He's, like, around Jello's level, to be quite honest. Okay, so it makes sense that they're both teaming. Yeah. Seal and AK, of course, uh, they're a bit more well-known around these parts. You know? Yep. Seal, like, at that level where it's, like, just under HM, but doesn't really come out enough to really hone it. Yeah. And uh, AK, you know, I see it come out a lot, but I don't really see him enter, you know? I just see him hang out with us. Yeah, he's usually the, the chill type, but he's definitely a team's boy, so whenever he gets the chance, he will enter. And he's already putting in the work, only at 18%, and everyone else is at 60 plus. Yeah, that's the thing, though. Like, when Sheik is on your team and you have a Robin on the same field, I feel like it's like poor Robin, you know? Robin doesn't really have that many options against Sheik. Yeah. Oh, but up, up air with really the Levin Sword. At 106, especially when Yoshi is such a heavy character. That Levin Sword is so strong. Makes sense though, I guess. Oh, they have the air dodge, really just have to seal taking that stock. Two stops apiece. However, uh, slight lead for blue team, 48%. Yeah, definitely slight lead. Uh, Jello right here looking at a pretty dangerous percent, whereas AK kind of sitting nice and pretty at 61%. Yeah, really good needles there. Yoshi was actually getting juggled quite a bit, but needles actually helped out uh, giving Jello a, a problem there. And right now what I'm seeing is basically the blue team is doing a really good job of maintaining stage control and green team is just struggling, you know, to get past their offensive pressure. You know, and, you know, they're losing stocks here and there. Hey, Arnold's already at 110% on his second stock. Yeah. He's going to have to go for a potential Nosferatu if he ever gets a chance. And that's the thing I'm noticing though, is that like, Seal is going in, you know, getting all these good hits in and AK is staying back, not really risking anything, but at the same time you know, being there to help his teammate with like needles or like, you know, he's not getting anything too crazy, but it's effective. Yeah. That's the role you want to play, actually. You want to be more uh, defensive, or whenever you guys are losing stage control, make her go aggressive, gain stage control, then go back to defense. And that downbeat is going to take that second stock from Hey Arnold. Uh, and now we got a five stock to three stock kind of scenario. Yeah. And Jello kind of sitting not very well at 83% here. Okay. Oh, Ooh, that yeah, that, those fireworks would have come in clutch, but unfortunately, does not get them. And now that side beyond the stage, I don't really know if I agree with that. Okay, that left and sword. Back oh, the left and, and sword. There. Stocks are even, but hey, Arnold and Jello, Jello definitely at the high percents. Ooh, wow, but that good combo. Yeah, that crazy uh, bowling ball into, and wow, he did not have a jump. Oh, his controller oh, he can't yeah. move. Well. Uh, we're pretty deep into this game, so I think yeah. we should just play it out. I mean, if you're if you're a frozen, yeah, you definitely you definitely take those. But all right, well, that was uh, weird.
But Jello not big enough for Brammer to do that. Yeah. All right, so now blue team at the deficit, but technically with the percentage, they sort of do have a lead. Yeah, you're right, actually, but there's still something wrong here. Jello just kind of taunting. Yoshi, I'm guessing he can't shield. What? Oh, wow, he actually can't drift. He actually can't move. All right, so there's some uh, technical difficulties here. All right, here. so sorry about this, boys. Um, and this ain't even wireless. That's the funny thing. This ain't me. Not sure if it's at his actual controller or if it's the adapter. Cause Anime. <coughs> Today seems kind of like a lazy day. You know? Yeah. Feels like a blue day, to be honest. Really? Yeah, I guess you're right. Are we all good? No, we're not good yet. But he did down smash. and Okay, okay, we're good. Yeah, it looks good. And all right, we're about to start it off. Yep. All right, so it looked like the controller just because uh, Seal got a new one and now it works fine. Oh, we just got a new one? Just bought out a new one? Uh, One of the EGE boys gave him one. EGE, yo. Just EGE. Rapid stream, but... Let's see how much... Oh, bad S smash by AK. Not sure why he went for that. Gets the up smash. And I wonder how blue team's going to do now that that entire uh, stop. I wonder if this is going to kill the momentum or... You know, just I mean, oh, good combo. I feel like it won't be that bad until... Uh, unless they can't get the kill on Hey Arnold. Okay, that was actually a very good attempt by Seal and AK. Yeah. Getting that back throw into the up air. Definitely some communication going on with them. But uh, Seal going a Yoshi. bit too yeah. aggressive. Eventually, it's going to oh, cost that him like that. Now it's up to Seal. I mean, AK. And yeah, this, as you said, is going to be detrimental because of the Sheik. SD that Seal had earlier. But it is Sheik, so. But Jello almost did beat Yo, one of our best Sheiks back at the weekly, so. Let's not forget also. With Thorn? Not enough. It's also Robin that they're dealing with, and that yeah. Leffen sword, you know, it's just. You know, oh, oh that's oh, yeah. Good. Rip. And wow, actually, uh, they definitely got robbed. Yep. They definitely did. Can't really say anything, but 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 that, but blue team can't let that get that in their head. So, and we've got Ontario boys in the background. Kim Forish standing in his jersey behind the green team, and uh, some of the other players behind blue team. Yep. All right, so I won't be surprised if they run this back to Battlefield. Battlefield yeah. Yeah. Honestly, the blue team had a lot of good pressure, especially with the uh, use of the platforms. So I feel like that would be their go-to, if not probably Dreamland. But I don't know if they want to risk earlier kills with Robin because. Oh. Cool. Well, that being said, it's not like uh, it's not like Dreamland actually has a lower ceiling, you know. Just. Well, and actually Jello, well it's smaller than Battlefield, at least. That's what I'm... Yeah, that's it, though. I, I do know that Jello actually does have a Mii Swordsman. Not like Mii Gunner. You got bodied by Ice Ninja, though. I mean, who hasn't, though? <laughs> Being real? I feel like Ice Ninja has at least bodied at least, like, everyone in the Ontario scene at least once. You know? Yeah. Except for maybe, like, yo. Anyways, game two. We switched to, uh, nobody, actually, but we're no. going to Smash, though. All right. Okay, I like this. Yeah, I like this for blue team a lot. You know, Cheekville, but Everyone not if just everybody running into that L run into the L win. You know. Okay, still getting a good combo on, and that's the thing about when you're in a kerfuffle with your teammate. You know, you don't really want to be matching buttons if you're both getting juggled. You know. Yeah. You want to just kind of get out just away. That's the thing a lot of new teams players or people who are not really familiar with teams do a lot. You know, they get panicky and they do panic situations, and it, it's always instrumental. You know, they always hit their team because of it. And again, it's a little like a repeat of game game one. Hey Arnold at very high percent, and then AK is just holding himself back. But just think about like I realized, Hey Arnold is really uh, has has an ability to kill at like 80ish percent, you know. So yeah. it's never the end of the world, especially with that rage. Eleven sword is just so strong, you know. They got checkmate combo, the down throw up here. Oh, but that nice. unsafe jab on the Sheik. Yep. So good stuff to seal protecting his teammate and getting the punish. Ooh, misses the uh, forward air up air follow up. Accidentally short hop instead. Okay, big combo. 
Okay, Jello not able to save his teammate. Kind of yeah. adding to the damage right there. And now, hey Arnold, trying to look for this up air finish on, I believe, Seal. Okay, and. Oh, literally volleying his partner around. Yeah, that's not a very good thing they'd be doing. Okay, Alright, double, double up, up air. air. One's gonna kill, though. The other's still living. Like that Levin Sword is actually so strong. Yeah. And good job to Jello for, you know, being kind of stock tanky right now. But uh, hopefully I didn't just jinx him. Oh, oh that, good that heal, yeah. but... Wow, and that bait! That was, a good te that was a good team play. I don't really know if it's a bait or just pure reaction on Jello's part, but... Good stuff to them. And right now, green team sitting in a lead. But of course, uh... Never mind. Commentator's curse. Oh, and then the dunk right after. Get him out of here. Down there. Oh, and that turn up definitely making that shield smaller than Adam right there. Okay, and that Levin sword hit. It looked kind of weak though, honestly. Maybe be a bit stale. But hopefully, uh, right now, green team just needs to get their composure. Stop hitting each other so much, and they really need to suck on Yoshi right now. Oh, no, it's, no, it's Villager. Villager. And while wow, these needles just putting in work. Oh, oh wow, that coverage. back air. That back air was so good. Really good coverage. Jello basically preventing him from landing on a Smashville platform. The Seal up Bs, and then covers. Hey Arnold covers that with a uh, back air there. Right now, they really need to focus on the Sheik here. Get his talk down, and then it'll be an even game. Yep. Okay, but Nostradamus heals. coming through as well. Yeah. Oh, but the thing about Nostradamus and the teams, not very effective when, uh, when there's another teammate on the field, unless the other team is keeping him busy. He backed away, I like it. Oh, but honestly, I feel like he should have gone the Sheik off the stage, and while the Sheik was recovering, he should have helped Jello out. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm smashed, goes unpunished though. Seal definitely getting a bit too antsy with those. He's gonna have to try to get set up. Oh, like that. Good yeah. potential. Uh, Right now, Green Team needs to hope that Jello loses his stock before Hey Arnold does, but Hey Arnold needs to hang on to his stock for as long as he possibly can. Yeah. Oh, okay. very nice. Yeah, very nice up smash. F smash actually pulling uh, Yoshi's body back and then leads him back forward. Right now, the Robin sitting at 120%. They really need to, the thing about this team is that they need to get the kill on Yoshi because Yoshi's the one that does the damage. And wow, that almost was a that was almost a kill confirm right there. Smart stuff by Seal jumping out using the double jump armor. Okay. Okay, that was a good conversion, actually. Not, not that bad. And he has the book in his hand. Big damage. Yeah, lots of damage. Coming through. And honestly, I think they need to kill. Oh, that's gonna oh, do it, though. He tried to throw on, but unfortunately, too much startup. Now it's up to Villager here. All right, let's see if Jello can do it, honestly. And that yep. exploding gyroid right in his face. Wow. Up and get him out of here. Yep. Okay, game two goes to red uh, to blue team. However, it is a uh, villager and Hey Arnold's counter pick. So, what do you think, counter pick wise? For a counter pick, I feel like they really need to go somewhere that allows them to get away from the Yoshi better, allows them to control the stage better as well. But one of the biggest downfalls in this matchup is that they're hitting each other a lot, you know. Yeah. And Hey Arnold's not very. Hammer has been getting all the kills, but he's also been letting himself get opened up really easily, you know? So something I'd recommend, honestly, in this stage, might just be maybe Lila, to be honest. But he's gonna not switch. I don't know why he keeps doing that. I actually think they're discussing mans, actually. But, um... Okay, duck hunt actually. Duck hunt. Uh, interesting, interesting choice. 
I feel like AK could benefit off benefit off of this just because like he needles. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like she uh, has a beneficial stance on the mid tier characters with needles. You know, on FD stages. She like just daring. One. Yeah, you know, like there's so much free space for them to kind of just uh, do whatever they want, throw whatever they want. It's gonna be very tough for a green team. Something that they rely on heavy zoning. Both characters rely on heavy zoning. Yeah. And two aggressive characters, you know. On a stage like FD, you know, aggressor always has the upper hand. Arguably, actually. Yeah, arguably. Yeah. It really depends how you play it, you know. There's not, uh... There's not like enough. Well, there's like a lot of room to get away from uh, from, from projectiles on a stage like this. So, jeez, my stutter. Pretty close game here, though. Yeah, Geno's gonna need to uh, channel like his inner and I, you know, like to get to come through. Okay, that back air. Back oh, air. and it's gonna kill, yeah. Barely gonna take the stock. And now, Jello kind of stole on these reactions, you know, from his teammate. Yeah. Okay, but back good back air to take that. And now, Jello's his stock tank for green team. Let's see how long he's able to carry that. Oh, that forward air. Not much. And now, this is actually the most even game they've had. And wow, <laughs> that Levin sword to slingshot. Big damage. Yeah, they just, these dares coming through. But overall, this has actually been pretty even. Okay, the berry. Oh, okay, the berry. Nice. Actually, something I realize now. Jello and uh and Hey Arnold have not been pocketing each other's things at all. Yeah. That's something they could actually come and clutch a bit later on, but you know, hopefully uh you know if they realize a quick play. Maybe they're trying to save it for last like they are right now. Like they haven't used it yet, so. Maybe they can go for it right like, quickly. Seal in trouble. Guy, keep in mind though, it does cut off a lot of knockback, and I think damage did get decreased. Okay, so it actually, it actually decreases it if you pocket it. Yeah. That's crazy. It should always increase, not by much though, just not as much as it does in singles. Oh, try to axe him out of shield, but and to get ground pounded. The Pele, reverse Pele. <laughs> Shout out to soccer. Bend the leg back him. Okay, uh, okay, that, that bad use of needles. I think uh, the pot and the needles kind of extended the hurt box. Yeah. Or the hit box, uh, or the hit stun. And that was enough time for Hey Arnold to get off that up air. But that forward smash, not going to do it though. Yeah. And wow, this is huge damage on Hey Arnold right here. That's something I really like seeing from green team. Whenever they have one of the members alone, they just get such a crazy amount of damage on them. Okay, good Look at that, there. look at these combos. Okay, bad use of needles there. Yeah. Doesn't take too much though. Okay, I like the forward air. And I'm just kind of the same situation that they had back in game two, where they really need to get the stock off Yoshi, and he only needs to hold on to the stock for as long as he can. Or well, both players actually need to hold though. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay, back. Okay, okay, okay. I, I guess because it wasn't going to kill. Wow, oh, good that back air. And now, now AK has to stay back. Now AK, like, yeah, he has to stay back, you know. Jello really needs to hold on to his stock as well. Oh, really Jello risky. actually saved him. Yeah. Okay, now this is actually very dangerous, you know. Dash attack? F okay, smash okay. for Yoshi. Okay, I like that AK's not getting too antsy because uh, Hey Arnold could do a, a jump up there. Oh, nice. Okay, now they just need to get the stock off of AK. Oh. Okay, double up here. Oh. oh, that was actually a very dangerous. Yeah. Okay. AK eating, sorry, Seal eating a lot of damage right now. He's going to have to chill on the S smashes. And AK might actually die to like dash attack or possibly even like a jab. Yeah. They need to try to focus on Jello a little bit. Yeah, blue team really needs to focus on getting Jello stock right yeah. now. Okay. Okay, now Seal can try to catch his landing. Okay. A bit willing with the... Oh, the back throw? Nope, Sheik's still living. Oh, this attack? Oh, okay. oh, my. And that's huge. Now, blue team cannot afford to mess this up. And wow, Jello really wants that stock. Yep. Jello needs, needs a, like, a back throw or something. 
I honestly think Seal should be the one behind throwing eggs while AK's in front. Oh, he oh, dies, wow, and now him. it's up to AK. Now this is actually a really big crowd. Yep. One tipper up smash will do it, though. One tipper up smash won many things, actually. Nope. Oh, Nair, okay. Oh. oh. Really dangerous. Now he has to watch out for the axe, too. Yeah, you gotta watch out for the axe. You gotta watch out for everything. Axe does a lot of shield damage, too. Oh. Oh, I think he accidentally picked up his own uh, his own tree with. <gasps> oh! A clutch power shield. Okay. Gravity grenade. Sorry. I don't even know what it's usually called. The skimming Besides grenade. The, yeah. Okay, this is. This is big. Though. And, wow, you know, for something so climactic, it's not very climactic. Up throw? Down throw up here? That was actually very dangerous for Jello right here. He needs a uh -oh. stock. Oh, almost pops the balloons. <laughs> my, favorite, my favorite part about, like, these intense 2v1s right here is that you can just look at the player's faces, like, especially, like, the player of the teammate. Yeah. It's like, can he do it, man? Just, just come on, let's go. <laughs> Jello choking really hard here. It's been a while since he even tacked up damage on the... AK. And wow, AK is playing this phenomenally right here. No, oh, that, as you say that. Triple turnip, sorry. As you say that. Commentator's curse. AK, definitely going to unfriend you on Facebook. <laughs>